we'll go into the next segment, the taste tester. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna bring our guest in as we talk about this, because you know what I'm saying? We're gonna, oh. we gonna we, we always try to taste the new liquor every uh every Thursday. So Drink what's this? Time. The name of this is called John Basil. John Basil. I, I gotta say it the proper way, John, John Basil. John Basil. John Basil. Basil. No, John Basil. No, I went to say you got a little eye on top of I went to say Basil. Baz Basil. You gotta say Basil. I thought that's just an eye. But when you get the apostrophe, it, it gets formed. That, that, I mean, is that an apostrophe? Yeah, Can you, you put it a little closer? Yeah, the little oh, the short bottle. Yeah, Basi. John Basi. And yeah, they said it's made Ooh. in Chicago. It's made in Ooh. Chicago. Okay. Yeah, All right, talk Chicago. to me now. Yeah, it's a it's a uh, John Basile. It's a uh, Chicago tequila. So All right. this is a hometown tequila yeah. that he, they got in the liquor store. Yeah. You feel me? And he, I really I kind of like it. I'm, I'm feeling kind of uh, under the influence. You know what I'm saying? I'm, All right, now nah. okay, and, now nah, it got John. a smooth taste. You know, it don't it's have smooth. a it don't have a bad taste. You it's know what I'm saying? So now I like I that, like that it, Kevin Hart shit. That's still the worst today. Yeah. They said you had to try the uh, the dark one. No, thank you. <laughs> they say you gotta try a different camera. You see what I'm saying? So we gonna see. We gonna go around and see. How, so how you feel about it? How you feel about this tequila? Um, honestly, it's, it's smooth. You know what I'm saying? Like uh, for a blanco. You know, sometimes that blanco hit kind of hard. It hit kind of harsh. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Kind of tart. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, real talk. But uh, no, that's real smooth. It tastes good. I, I just mix mine a little bit with this Calypso. You know what I'm saying? If you in Chicago, you already know the little Calypso, a little, little lemonade. Little thing, you, know you know what I'm saying? saying? Yeah, I ain't trying to get too, um, you know, off it. But uh, it's good. Yeah, because it's already 420. We can't be doing oh, too yeah. much. Oh, yeah, man. So we're we going to ask our guests, what's your... Let's, let, let the guests bring his. I let people bring their stuff in. Right. That. I, okay. Let me, first, I got to turn my mic on. My mic on? Yeah, oh, your no, mic on. Get, a, I got to get you a whole. A bum, 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 bum. I wasn't even yeah, ready. I get you a. Yeah, uh, you was bum, coming bum, bum, in. Yeah. I didn't even know you was. Yeah, right. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> I didn't even know you was coming in this in, in, in this. in this moment. Because yeah, he's drinking the liquor too. So I'm going to ask him, uh, you know what I'm saying, give his opinion on it. Because he, he taste testing it. You know what I'm saying? See? I'm, I'm going to tell y'all straight up, man. Um, this John Bazil. Is it Basil? Yeah, John Basil. Yeah, the Blanco. Yeah. I don't know about the Reposado or nothing else, but this Blanco is hit. Yeah, I like this it. This Blanco is a hit, Joe. So, and and uh, I just Googled it real quick. When you told okay. me it's from Chicago, uh, I had to hit the Google, and it's owned by a black man. Damn. But we need to hit up John. He's a Harriet Tubby of this shit. Come on, Harriet. He, he African, because his name I cannot pronounce. Udemo oh, yeah. Umolu Udemo Udemo. Channel Come on now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I jumped in. It, it's the founder of the premium tequila brand, John Brazil, established in 2018. So, congratulations well, to bro right. for getting it in, man. Oh, we going to have to find him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check him out. He, you walk right past, bro. Like, you you know what I'm saying? Just, yeah, okay, oh, yeah, man. Yeah. Okay, shout out to him, man. He doing he his like a regular nigga. Yeah. Yeah, he's like a regular one. That's what's up. It's good to, it's good to, uh, to see that. It's, yeah. a, it's a nice looking bottle. Yeah, and yeah. it's a nice bottle that you can ha hold on to when you, you know what I'm saying? And hit a motherfucker with it. And, yeah, you might can hit a motherfucker with it. In the event you need to defend yourself. You will definitely be in jail. You can defend yourself <laughs> with, with the John Basile bottle. Yeah, you oh, definitely damn. can defend yourself with this bottle. Like, it's a good, you know what I'm saying? It's like a nunchuck. But you know what? It's one of those real nice bottles that you want to take. You know, you give it to your auntie. And she takes, she, 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 so, she, you know, they rub the stuff off of it, then they cut the top off of it, and they make it to an ashtray and a oh, other shit. Base. Oh, they yeah. They be making all types yeah. of shit with these bottles yeah, that, these that, days. That, that, you know, that, know what I'm saying? It's pretty nice. That yeah. is pretty nice. Auntie like definitely going to be yeah, like, nephew, you, 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 you looking out for I your had auntie. an 1800 bottle that was turned into a bomb. You had to stand up to hit that motherfucker. It was four feet They be tall. turning them into hookah little bases, too. Yeah. Oh, so, wow, yeah, they be yeah. doing all type of, a lot of, do a lot of creative shit with a bottle. You know what I'm saying? White people. <laughs> nah, that, that's nigga <laughs> shit. Yeah. <laughs>